So, last class I already told, for finding mean, there are three methods. Out of that only two you have to study. The first method is direct method. So, direct method formula also I told, x bar is equal to sigma xi fi divided by capital N. That is direct method formula. So, here you are getting a grouped data. First column is class 0 to 10, 10 to 20, 20 to 30, etc. Okay. But our formula is x bar is equal to sigma xi fi divided by capital N where capital N is the sum of all the frequencies that is already given 50. Okay. So these are our fi's. But what is our xi? Okay. So this xi means class mark. What is xi? xi means class mark. So last class I told class mark is equal to lower limit plus upper limit divided by 2. Class mark formula lower limit plus upper limit divided by 2. So for the first class 0 to 10 lower limit is 0 upper limit is 10. So 0 plus 10 by 2 that is 10 by 2 5. So this is our xi. So this column you have to write as xi. Then 10 plus 20, 30 by 2, it is 50. 20 plus 30, 50 by 2, it is 25. Okay. So now you see, no need of calculating every time plus and by 2. So first itself you have to see whether the given class is having equal class size or class width. Class size or class width means it is the difference between two continuous lower limits. So these are the two continuous lower limits. Difference is 10. These are the two continuous lower limits. 10 and 20. Difference is 10. 20 to 30. Difference 10. Or if you take it here 40 and 50, 10. 60 and 70, 10. Okay, so if the class size equal or class width equal, after getting the first xi, first xi you have to find lower limit plus upper limit by 2, 5. Then you going on adding class size. What is our class size? Class size you got 10. That you have to add 5 plus 10, 15 plus 10, 25 plus 10, 35, plus 10, 45, plus 10, 55, plus 10, 65. Okay. No need of calculating always plus and by 2. Now, you have to find the next column. It is called the XI, FI. XI, FI you have to find. Then that you have to add. By adding you will get the sum. So multiply xi and fi. This is our fi column. This is our xi column. 4 into 5, 20. 4 into 15, 60. 7 into 25, 175. 10 into 35, 350. 45 into 12. 45 into 10 is 450. 45 into 2, 90. So 450 plus 90, 540. 8 into 55. 8 fives are 40. 8 fives are 40 plus 4, 44. 5 into 65. 5 fives are 25. 5, 6, 30 plus 2, 32. Okay. Now we want total of this column. Okay. This xi we don't want. We want only total of fi and xi fi. Add 5 plus 5, 10. 2 plus 1, 3. Plus 4, 7. 11. 16. 
16 plus 7, 23, plus 6, 29, plus 2, 31. 3 plus 3, 6, 10, 15, 18, 9. Okay, 1 and 1 zero you got. So, what is our x bar? x bar is equal to 1 and 1 zero divided by 50. These two cancel. Then 191 divided by 5. 19 by 5 is 3. 4 balance 41 it is 8. 1 balance so 0.2. This is our V. So this method is called the direct method. So in direct method you will get the class interval or class column and frequency column. You have to prepare the third column XI. XI means class mark. Definition of class mark is lower limit plus upper limit by 2. And next column is XI, FI. Then apply the formula, you will get. So mean X bar is equal to sigma XI, FI divided by N.